hi all so today in this video we are going to see like how to use this uh, uh, feature called writing to related records so in this new version of appian that is 23.3 version appian has introduced a new functionality that you can directly write in the related records as well so we will see like how we can do it okay so initially the process was like this and after that the process like this so we will try to recreate both the kind of cases and we will see like how efficiently we can write it to the related records okay so uh, what was happening before was see this is a kind of you know like a example that we are going to take so it was in appian 23 appian 23.2 we were doing okay so first of all some user input task was there okay then we used to write in a particular country and then we update the city with the country id then we write in the city so initially you know like for this example what we will do here is we will take two records first record is just simple okay first record is of country okay for the country it is country id and name i have taken okay rest are just metadata fields country id and name and for city we should know like this city belongs to what this city belongs to what country so country id fk will also be there fk representing that this is the primary key of some other table okay and then the obviously the city name so only these three fields are are done here okay so uh, our record is set as of now so now to get started with this one what we will do here is first of all let's go and create our ui here okay so we will create a ui here where we will try to add a country and their respective cities as well okay so how we will do here is let's try to take a form for the e ha and to add means one country can have you know like multiple uh, cities or states you can say so i will just add you know like kind of here editable grid. now let's go here and try to configure this form first of all this is uh, the value so we will need here our country ri so it with country here so the value of the country will be ri by country dot name okay that's fine this is how we used to write the name for our records okay dot name so country is done so any country you added okay let's add our india okay and we will be able to see like country india got added here great so india is now added here now in this editable grid what will happen is that okay it is okay and this so these are the different cities so city will i will just take you know like what we will do is we will just take a single uh, row only okay a single header cell we will take it okay and for the column as well we will do here column grid column config okay and width and all we will you know like uh, we will just keep it let's say medium because it's just one so doesn't much matter okay now the name of the header cell will be our city name what city you are going to add okay now in the rows we have to take here for each okay so in for each what over which item we need to iterate now here comes the twist like how we have because you know, like the important expect in writing here is like uh, it is saying like a uh, writing related records first of all we should know like i whether these the records means we are trying to write city in you know like uh, we will just take only one uh in the process we will design just country only so whether these two records are even related to each other or not and how we can find that two records are related to each other or not so i have created a city record here okay and i have taken a field called country id fk by declaring a column called country id fk which will store this country id pk data of the country uh, like is it fine done okay or we need to make any other change as well so what we will do here is uh you know like first of all we have to make them related so in order to make them related we have to add relationship between them then only they can become related to each other okay so it means that uh, how we can add relationships okay see one country can have multiple cities okay similarly we we can directly add a relationship as well okay so let's add relationships of ys city okay 
so i will add relationship with that record okay let's first of all you know, like uh, this name this relationship as country to city fine now one country can have many cities so here you will see here one country id i have taken and the city id okay so here also it is in city table also country id fk is present now here is that uh, you know like what appian is talking about like by writing related records so this is where see here here in the screenshot also they have given like allow updates to task when modifying cases so here also our change would also be there allow updates to cities when modifying city, countries that's what we want whenever a new country is added and their cities is added we want the same thing to be up, applied here as well so we will allow the updates to them now we will add it here now once we have added let's save our changes okay and let's save it here as well no change here now we will see it is now related to each other they are now related to each other with the help of relationships now they are related records now when i will try to like uh, items initially what would have happened is that if we were trying to do so we would have taken another city one okay and it will be uh, a city record okay and it will be an array that's how we used to create any table grids okay that's fine okay and then would we would iterate over you know like ri bang uh, city this is how we used to do okay and then in the expression we will you know like uh, take our grid row layout that's how so that's how we we would have done it here right so in the contents value of the city will be ri bang ri bang city dot fields dot city name okay and the save into as well okay and some we will also put here uh, what we used to do after this rows okay add rolling so in the add row link we will we would have used a dynamic link here okay and for the save into we will use here a bank save oh sorry label i forgot okay without label nothing will show okay add city so let's you know like i have added some city here okay so a bank save target is where so target is our okay city okay and the value that we need to save here is a bank sorry a bank save it is already there okay so we will save here now we will write here append okay so append means what where we want to append the data the array so city is completely an array and every time i update i want a blank city name to be there right so it's better you know, like take a local variable and there you uh, take you know like kind of format or type uh, cast for this city data okay local bank city so i will just make it here ys ys city is there okay and here city name okay not city id okay let's check city name is equal to initially it will be null so every time i append i want this you know like this local to get appended because every time whenever we click on this link some empty city get appended then only we will, user will write some data okay so see here as of now okay what will happen add city so when you will try to add city you know like one empty city get added again you will try to add the city one again empty city will get added that's how we used to add it previously but now what we will do here is okay instead of directly iterating over ri bank city we will take here is ri bank country and dot relationships now with the help of relationship also we can go to city okay so that's it till here we will try to iterate where this text field should go and store okay so this is the contents here for this one okay and it will be also you know like uh, not ri bank instead of this we can sorry i have given ri bank okay because it is inside for each we should give here fv bank okay not ri bank ri bank is not correct okay fv bank uh, sorry uh, let me just remove it here so we will use here fv bank okay item okay and then we will use city so here you have to use as you have used before so here we can use the same thing okay let me just copy it here and paste it here as well and that's it so in this way we can also add our city now in the target initially we used to store in this array of cities but now what we will do here is again we have to go in the country from the country we have to go in relationship and to the city 
okay now for the append as well the same thing you know like the same thing will happen here as well okay so let me just give enter so that it will be easy to uh, understand and instead of this one we will just take here city okay let me delete the extra huh arriving country dot city and what data you have to store okay so now i guess it is fine then let's try to add a city okay so now every time you know, like let's add a city called you know like let's say jaipur is one city and another city let's try to add here patna so i have added two city and see here two city got added here city name is not coming here where is this value okay sorry now in the cities table i don't even have to look i can delete this rule input i was checking city table only no i have to just i have to just check my country table now because whenever i it will add any value it will get added in my country rule input only right so here in the country c it is added now again i will add here another city called patna now it will get added here as well so in the second ri now it got added see here so this is how we have to make our ui so whenever you are trying to like re related records i have taken example of two you know like one country can have any similarly it can be it can be done for the one to one as well one to many many to one as well all this record it will try to follow the same approach only you just have to create one ri only now we will see how in the process we have to make it okay a process model for this one now let's go here okay let's try to click on create in process model it will become very simple as appin has specified like uh, now once you have you know like uh, cre created your data once you have created your data then okay then just write in one record only and the related records will get automatically updated okay this is the ui store country and so this is the ui that we are going to add as of now we will just add our ui store country and city ui so okay so it becomes very easy to you know like add the things here now we will go here and in the assignment we will try to add the initiator forms is already added here that's fine and now we will go in the data tab and we will store the process variable. so creating you can also create easily some process variable directly from here see while hovering it says new process variable. the name and the type will automatically get say you know like selected so we don't have to worry about like uh, which name and type we are going to uh, select so in xor what happens like cancel we will configure okay so is it cancel or not and then finally our write records so finally the write records a smart service and then we will try to connect these two nodes together okay so it will become right to country and city but how right so here we don't have to uh, configure much we in setup just go there and country because as an ri only country will get you know like uh, uh, will only country will come up here okay now in the decision we will go and check the conditions here as well so we have one process variable cancel and if it is equal to true if it is equal to true then just go to end node otherwise go to country and this one so this is how we will store okay country and city fine uh, okay so let me just validate it once everything is correct here let's just save it and now check it before saving and checking you know, like let's see you know like uh, let's see like how does our data looks like because you know, like i'm just trying to write in my country record so how does the country record look like when you try to add it here so let me try to add a mumbai city here when you will try to see the data of the country you will see your data like this see here how it is so initially record type country is the india and then country to city one related record is there and then mumbai so automatically should go and update the data as well okay so now here we will try to debug our process as well let's debug this process okay and let's uh, let me add here a city okay so our country india will get okay added okay and uh, let's add a city called you know like let's add varanasi okay and i will add one more city called patna so i have added try to add in like a two city here and click on submit so it should go and uh, add 
two cities of data automatically there so it has written in the related records automatic automatically now see how in the database it would have written so first of all let's go in the city see here for the city it has written varanasi and patna and country id automatically is, is taken for because some previous country were already there okay india has already added two times one more time we have added the same country here so fourth id is the one and country is also it is taking the you know like for the city automatically it has taken the fourth id so first of all it written in the country table generated the id and then written in other table so in this way you know, like this right to related record is working okay so i hope it was helpful just focus on creating one ri where you know like uh, with the help of that parent ri only all the related records it should uh, be able to hold then it can easily write into different tables as well okay so that's all for now thank you